What is up, everybody? Welcome back to baseball right here on youtube.com slash Sean and Rex. My name is Sean. Today we continue the Seattle Mariners season game number 147. Logan Gilbert on the mound today. He is an even 12 and 12 and 24 decisions, a 3.88 ERA on his side. Noah Syndergaard, he is going to start for the Angels. He's 9 and 12 with a 4.45 ERA as the Mariners and the Angels meet in a uh, the in game one of a four game series. Last road trip of the season for the Seattle Mariners. We'll be on the road for the next 10 games. Four against uh, Los Angeles, three against Oakland, three against Kansas City, who you saw yesterday knock, uh, get out a win, get out a win, get a win uh, against the Minnesota Twins. I have no idea what that pop-up was, but all right. Take a look at the calendar. We're three and a half games ahead of the uh, Houston Astros. We don't see anybody really uh, important or of note. We have um, Kansas City and Oakland. A lot of divisional matchups after facing a lot of AL Central teams. We finally get some division opponents. Uh, let's see. Standings really quick. Three and a half games clear. Pretty good. Astros and Yankees are going to probably lock those spots down in not too long. The Rays are three and seven. They were kind of the best opportunity to shake up the playoffs. Uh, with, But with... The Astros winning five in a row. The Yankees eight and two in their last 10. I don't know that you're really going to overcome these uh, top five teams who are in the wild card uh, in the wild card race. So there you have it. Let's jump on into today's game. Baseball every day, 7 p.m. Pacific time right here on the channel. So we'll go ahead and play full game. I'm playing as the Mariners, please. Thank you. Uh, we'll go regional theme, hybrid, clear skies, Logan Gilbert, Frazier, Crawford, France. Okay, I want to tweak this lineup a little bit. Uh, you know what? I O'Keefe says he's, it says O'Keefe is hot, but I'm going to actually throw Cal Raleigh in because he's a switch hitter, and that will help. Lewis for Crawford, France for Marte, Fraley for T. Williams, T. Williams for Frazier. Um, no, whoops, whoops. Okay, so we have three switch hitters in the lineup. That's good. Gives us an advantage regardless of so we have one, two, three. Let's see, we have three of everything. Three, three. So we'll either, we'll have six advantage bats and three non-advantage bats. Let's get this lineup set the way I want it. Actually, we're pretty good. Ba Uh, skip. Skip. <laughs> a couple of guys that have not played in some games, but they will, uh, they'll wait another couple of days. I just don't, I don't need them. Otani's in the lineup. I don't see a Mike Trout. Rendon, though, can be, Dom has Thompson proved to be a problem Williams. before. Now at the plate. Thompson Williams enters the day among the league leaders in batting average, but he'll need to get hot if he hopes to win the title. Hang on. Hold on. I need... Uh... Oh, no. I don't know that I can get back to where it was. Oh, no. Why can't I exit? It didn't give me a... It didn't give me a thing. It skipped all the... I skipped all the jargon. I can't just quit out either because I haven't saved the ha <laughs> Um well and he deals. I don't know why I even swung at that. What the hell happened there? It just skipped everything, right? Yeah. Why did it do that? Next pitch is downstairs. Huh. Uh this is inconvenient. So I right deals. Here's the worst part about this. 
God, I hate the stadium. I hate the stadium with this angle. I hate it. Right up here is hard. It makes it hard to see the ball. Yeah, I just struck out. I'm so irritated. Well, I think that was just a case of a hitter quitting on a pitch. He was looking fastball. Okay, we'll hit it up. So now I don't have the thumbnail for this game, so I got to figure out how that's going to work. But the, here's the problem. The problem is I haven't saved since I have. This is Kyle Lewis. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. Since I've been recording today. So I can't, like, go back. Hit in the air, right field. Uh, I can't, like, quit and exit. I can't save and exit because it's not going to... Oh, that's so annoying. Why did it skip all of that? Why did I not save? I knew I should have saved. I clicked A to do, like, the new thing, and I was like, oh, uh, you know what? I should save. I should just go back, and I should save it real quick, call it good, uh, and then I just did not do that, and now I'm irritated. That hits the dirt. Ball one. Sinker at 97, a fastball tops out at 101. Change up at 90, slider at 92, curveball at 82. Next pitch is I cannot up. see the fucking ball because of that stupid ass indent. I and hate playing in this stadium. I hate this stadium so much. And the line of the pitch. I might just have to use the one with the starting lineups or something as the the thumbnail the pitch that's, that's a bad pitch logan gilbert's on the mound today we didn't get a look at his stats this game is a whole mess right now this is a good time for something off speed away he steps on the bag we usually do have to survive a couple of innings because of the way that this stadium is designed it is really hard to see the baseball at the release point. He, dives, but he, can't make the catch. he can't make the catch, but he can make the throw for the out, Abraham and Toro. With a nice play right there. Anthony Rendon, the next to hit for the Angels. Three hits in the ball game on Wednesday. And first offering is fouled off. I hate when I have those moments of like, here's this thing you should do, and I just kind of ignore myself. The one one. Swing and attack for the rolls foul. Is there a little wrinkle to that? I think there was. Yeah. A little slider action. Bounced up the middle. Fires Got him. over to first. That takes care of Rendell. That ends the frame. Angels go down one, two, three. We played an inning, no score. Yep. Bob the table a little bit. Now batting Mitch Hanniger. All right, Mitch Hanniger, 52 home runs this season with a 293 average. Triple crown categories. Mitch Hanniger. The right hander back to work. And that's outside. That's outside. Once we get to the th once we get to the third inning, it shouldn't be as much of a problem. Swing at a ball lifted to center field, and that yeah, that'll get down for a hit. And the leadoff man aboard. Well, as hot hitting continues, he's been getting great results lately. When you flare a ball out behind second base, it's really a tough spot for anyone to get to, and you're never trying to do that as a hitter. But when you do, oh, Sean, no. The entire way to get down. On the ground could be two with two strikes may see some movement over there at first base trying to stay out of a double play here next one just misses gonna count one and two really good take especially with two strikes bad swing going for everything today which is not good much more patience in the last one Belt and fires. Stays alive. Oh. 
and a pitch. Now one missed. Left hand batter waits. Three and two count here. Tap back up the oh, that sucks. He'll take the sure out at first, which is fine, but that's what a good sinker is designed to do. Get a guy to roll that's bummer. That's bummer. That's a bummer. Abraham Toro digs in now. That's a terrible swing. Stop it. Oh, I got off to such a discombobulated start. Oh, this is awful. Good sinker ball. If you can get in that location, boy, you've got to look top to bottom, and that's going to make it very difficult to hit. Pinder settles underneath it. He's got it, and there's two away. Oh, he throws it away. Here's Adam Frazier. Adam in there for strike one looks like he's just sizing him up there really good pitch to hit but he took it all the way sometimes guys just want to set their timing later on in the game that may be a pitch that he turns on Yeah, now two balls and a strike. That's where you want it. It's a good miss. Runner at second, two down. Oh, that's a bad swing. That's a 3-1 count. Come on. Swing and a ground ball out to short. Newman to first in town. And that's the third out. Mariners lead one. Right, we'll it's go getting easier to see already, which is pretty good. I can't believe the game did that to me. I set my controller down on the table. I wonder if I like hit it at just the right millisecond to skip all of that. Swing and a miss. And that is strike one. Gilbert. He's the kind of starter that a lot of pitching coaches and managers as well really appreciate. Not a guy who's going to get himself into trouble by dancing around, by walking guys. Yeah, he throws strikes, and you know he's got the command to be in the zone, be effective, but just moving the ball around, getting the ball back from the catcher booth, and throwing the pitch. One, two now. Just misses with that one. It's an interesting thing when you consider limiting walks. Is it more important today because of how many home runs are being hit? No doubt. Damn. Guys Perfect the thread balls, right there. The way the swings and the launch angles are today, the emphasis of hitting home runs is so huge. It's that never been, been more important. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him. So that one has to feel good. That's a good sound coming off the top. That's a strike. Go, oh, come on. Into the outfield. That's one of those swings where you just don't even feel the ball hit the barrel. That's a pure stroke. And now they've got some speed on first. So we'll see if they try to get him into motion. And there's a fly ball deep yeah, right Yeah, that's a home run. That one is gone. Oh, man. It's 2 nothing. That is frustrating. I mean, it's a great hit by Otani. Like, no problem there. The frustrating piece is two missed calls. Two missed calls at the bottom of the zone. I, you got to go in the zone. You don't want to fall 3-0. The hitter did a nice job of turning that pitch around, not missing it, and a hitter's count. Next pitch has popped up. Hayes under it. Brings it in. One down. Yeah, I think the other part, though, as well, is it goes both ways because... 
I think the guys at times are more than willing to give up walks because they'll come back and strike the next guy out. Number five, the next to hit. First pitch, and he just misses. Top of the zone for a called strike. Still only one out here in the inning. In the air, fairly deep to right field. Hanniger pulls it down, two away down. Batting eight. The batter That's now, Kevin Newman. Kevin. Newman. Swing and a pop-off in foul ground. Racing makes the catch. And that'll do oh, it. I don't know why I thought. I thought we'd maybe get like the, the dual logos. Damn it. So we fall behind by multiple runs here again early. It's just three games in a row we've given up a home run. And welcome back. Yeah, the batter down. That puts us behind. Obviously able to come back in the last couple. Hopefully we can do the same here. Go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Next one is off the plate. You mean while they're getting nice calls from the umpire? That those were both strikes. The pitch. That's off the mark. And now three and zero. Oh. Swings and lifts one to deep center field. That's back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. Batting now. now batting Key Brian Hayes. Number 13. Key Brian Hayes. First pitch just misses. Righty delivers. Of the Come on. No, oh, Sean. The pitch upstairs. And now two and two. Two, two down. Little dribbler up along third, and he grabs it in foul ground. The pitch. Out of line, out towards center. Darn. That was the curveball I was kind of looking for. Got under it. Don Thompson Williams up next for the Mariners. Thompson Williams. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Two down, nobody on. Oh, darn it. Tosses to first. That's out number three. Mariners go down quietly there. They trail it here, 2 nothing. Welcome back as we go to the last of the third. So in now for the Angels, Joe Adele. The right fielder. Going one. Well, he looks fresh out there. Just... Needs to get a little more confidence and remember how good he's been in the past. Next offering is in for a strike. Good looking fastball right there. Surprised he didn't take a rip at that. I think he got locked up a little bit. That one the other way. That's a base hit. So now back to the top of the order. Really nice job, a two strike hit in that at bat. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel base, really man. good about Game what you did at the plate. You trusted Watch your it. hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the barrel straight to it. That's great work right there. Fletcher, we did get bumped up to the legend the plus difficulty strike. setting in the last game. Right hander kicks deals. That does sometimes give me some trouble. He may have not liked either of those first two pitches or agreed with the umpire's calls, but at this point, he's going to have to bear down and be ready to hit anything close to the zone. 
Here's a one-two. Ground ball left side. Oh, and it hits the base. And it finds its way through for a hit. Safe at first as they can't make the play. Good two-strike hitting right there, Boog. A bit of a lost start for Sal, no, so that was nicely Better done to beat the odds. There's right there. something about pulling one down the line and shooting it through the infield that's just so satisfying as a hitter. It's just fun turning on a pitch like he did right there. And next for the Angels, Brandon March. And that's in there for strike one. Left-hand hitter waits. And that one is lifted in the air. Lewis coming on. Snags it on the run. One away. All right. We can turn a double play. We can get out of this situation. Nice play there by Lewis in the outfield. Rendon making his way to the plate. Rendon. And first offering is fouled off. Two on, one out. Fouled off. He was late. Adele, the lead runner out at second. Fletcher at first, one gone. Come back to the mound. Steps on the bag for one. And he'll eat it and be happy with the out. Now back. Shohei Otani up to the dish. Shohei And the first pitch misses for ball one. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Lewis ranging to his right. And he makes the catch. I uh, should have had the double play, the but inning. that's all right. Strand a couple. They're up 2 nothing. Back in Anaheim. Out of the fourth. And stepping in for the Mariners, Kyle Leading Lewis. The, Mariners, the center fielder, number one, Kyle Cindergaard back to work. And a good fastball to start him off. That's strike one. Kicks and deals. One ball, one strike. Good eye right there. Next offering in the dirt, and the count is three and one. Expect for that guy to come right at you with a fastball, something in the zone, because he does not want to allow the leadoff wall. Damn it. Three one in for a strike, full count. Everything's been low. It makes me hesitant to cheat down that way, but that one okay. misses. Just way so missed that one. All right, Cattell well, Marte, you you're coming up here. Two, you had a grand slam in the last that's game. That's the pitch he has the most confidence in right now. Just where would that where was that ball going? That looked weird to anybody else. Enters the day among the league leaders in batting average, but he'll need to get hot if he hopes to win the title. Swing and a hard hit liner up the middle of the base hit. Lead runner holds up. They're at first and second with nobody out. Now batting. Right That's about as textbook Nick. as it gets. Got his stride and load out of the way early. He stayed inside that ball and squared it up out front. Man, that was like he was in the cage hitting off a tee. Mitch Hanniger will hit next. Hanniger hoping to lock up a home run title down the stretch. He leads the league right now. Late swing, fouled off. Damn it. First and second here, no outs. Next one misses, and now it's even one and one. Yo, know, Boog, if you're that base runner at second base, you want to be quiet out there. Not bouncing around, not distracting your teammate, the hitter. Make sure that he can clearly focus on that pitcher and that release play. Pinder in position. Makes the catch. And that is a big first out. That yeah, sucks. A wasted RBI opportunity, but that sucks. Like him, he is looking forward to making up for it in his next at bat. J.P. Crawford gets a chance to hit. Grounded out back to the pitcher his first time. Pitch misses That's fine. inside. All right. We can do this. We can try and at least get a run here. He never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. 
Swing and bless one down the line. It's gone if it's fair. Fuck me. We have seen a lot of those over the last week or so. No, 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 God. On now to the bottom of the fourth. Angels two and the Mariners nothing. Back here at the ballpark, Omar Narvaez at the plate. And leading off for the Angels, the catcher, Omar Narvaez. And here it comes. The other way. That's a base hit. So a man on base to start the inning. That is infuriating. I should have known that this game was going to be a disaster when it didn't even give me the opportunity to get a fucking thumbnail. God damn it. That is, it's so irritating to me for some reason. I, well, it's not that necessarily. It's irritating to me that I had a gut feeling that I should have saved before I started this game and I didn't and it bit me in the ass that double play sucks I was I thought it was going to get over I the pitch way inside and that hit him he had two strikes on him and he hit him well a few things can go wrong when you are delivering a pitch that grip slip out of your hand release point wind up all of those things and I think it's safe to say at least one of those if not more than one got away from him to the plate. Back up the middle in a base hit. Narvaez around third. Torres with a relay home. He beats it safe. It's three zip. That's back to back singles for him. Just a very nice approach and swing right there to use the big part of the field. Everything was on time. Stayed balanced through the entire swing and just launched that one into center. And puts the squeeze on that. Runner tagging for third, and he moves up 90 feet. Runners at the corners now. One away. The right Here's Joe Adele. Seven. Joe Adele. And that one fouled off. Number four on third. Number five over at first with one away. I was really off. trying to get... I was just too aggressive trying to get that run across. I'm so frustrated. Next offering misses. Now one and two. Of course, I lost the batter hitting him with the stupid the fucking circle change. Extended, which you have to be careful of is that pitch that's up, that's in on your hands. That'll pop you up in the infield, and that's exactly what the pitcher. Cut wants. him down to the plate. Excellent throw by Hanniger. Number three inning over. Well, as a full outfielder, this play when you get the this is, these are the games that are the most frustrating. I'd probably say that about like nine or ten different types of games. But I went, in, went into this game with a lot of confidence. I went into this game having feeling good at the plate. The pitching's been all right, though I was a little worried with the, the difficulty boost. They're a team that I probably should be beating from a record perspective, but there is always the possibility that they have just had my number. Off, Missed a home run with off. J.P. Crawford. That sucks. We've had a couple of those lately the that have just been pitch. so heartbreaking. And it's one and one. And the righty deals. On the and then the instead third. we're getting hits on that sort of Whips stuff. Or contact, not even hits, but contact. Oh, a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Frazier batting for the second time, and that's strike one. He's working low in the zone, which is always worrying to me. The next pitch misses. And Obviously, it's you know to induce a lot of ground balls and all that sort of stuff. But as soon as I start cheating low, that's when I start to get real bad pop ups. Slice or in that way, case, at least a uh, single in the left. He needed that one. It's been a tough stretch now to play it. lately. Get Didn't try to do too much now. with it. Just a really Whoa. controlled, simple swing. We don't see a whole lot of that these days with guys trying to launch and hit home runs. But sometimes you got to shorten up just like that. One gone runner at first. Here's the catcher, Cal Raleigh. First offering misses the mark. And 
And a pitch. Line drive, base hit. They fired in quickly, so it's first and second with only one away. The third base. So first and second with one man gone. Key Brian, Key Brian Hayes, Hayes now at the plate. Lined, and that's a base hit. Frazier headed for the plate. Get out there. Oh, that was close. It's three one. That was so close. Just so sound in his mechanics. Hits against the firm front side. And the hands just continue to carry through the middle of the field. Back to the top of the Seattle order. Dom Thompson Williams up next for the Mariners. That's fine. That's Slider in, in the outside corner, no problem. Ball to get a double play and out of this jam. Oh, I gave him exactly what he was looking for. Damn it. It was the pitch I wanted. I wanted the changeup. I wanted the off speed, and I just missed it. Damn it. Head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's David Fletcher. The pitch. And leading off for the Angels. The second base. the outside corner. David. That's strike one. Fletcher. A little bit low. Nope. Next offering is downstairs. You got two balls, one strike. Kicks and fires. And that one fouled off. And the right hander deals. The punch out there. And one out now. Next to hit, Brandon Marsh. Now batting. Center fielder. Brandon. Marsh. In there and it's 0-1. Well, in an 0-0 count, not every strike is a good strike for a hitter. I like the plate discipline there. Next pitch misses. One ball, one strike. Righty delivers. Pulls that one foul. And a pitch. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. Makes the grab, two down. The third baseman, number six, Anthony. Red Had a little goal. smidgen of extra Here's carry there at the Red end. Up to the plate. Important. If he can go one, two, three here, will be a very positive sign for him and for his team. Just a slow ground ball this time. Slings it across. Okay. Inning over. See if we can uh, Angels held continue in the rhythm at the plate. See if we can get some get some hits here. We have five hits, but only and one run. Back. Started the six, John Chambi with Chris Singleton. Leading off and leading Lewis. off, Kyle the Lewis. Center fielder, number one, Kyle go, Lewis. A line to kick the pitch. And that gets the oh, the come on. So important for him to control Are you serious? Right He's got to go through the heart of this lineup. That misses, and that's ball one. The wind of the pitch. And that one almost got him. Straighten him up a little bit. It's late on that one. Froze me. As they get the oh, absolutely six. froze Here's me right there. God ten. damn it. The batter, number four, designated hitter, yeah, he swings and Bad swing. I went all for it. I, I like wanted everything right there. On the first pitch, it was going to sell out to it. 
Didn't make any contact though. Up the middle. This is bad. This is very bad. I'm putting myself in bad positions from a count perspective, and I'm not. Stepping in the long ball threat. Mitch One for two. Swing and a high I've missed two home runs now. How the fuck was I early on a 96 mile an hour pitch? In the year left field. Is that gonna go? Is that gonna go? No, it's not. That is the third out of the inning. Missed one with Haniger, missed one with Crawford. This Nobody is a frustrating it's game. It's a three one ball game. Welcome back. Now it's the DH. Shohei Otani. Gilbert back to work. The designated hitter. There's a strike. It's good speed at the top of the order here. You want to get it on, see if you can get a stolen base, maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. The pitch. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Trying to build the confidence in that slider a little bit. from him much, but he's got a really good feel when he throws it. That's the third. That is Can't not going to And he'll be safe at first. No, it shouldn't. Probably shouldn't be an error. I don't think Key Brian Hayes was going to get to it anyway. Narvaez in the box again. Takes a strike. And he'll one. That slider breaking in could be a tricky pitch if you don't finish it and have that bite at the end and it stays out over the plate. And out number one on the ground. Nice play by Key Brian Hayes on that one. The other one, I again, don't blame him on at all. I mean, that's a, that's a long run and Otani is fast. In there for strike one. And that's a great take right there. Even though it's a strike, with the situation run on first base, you want to keep the ball off the ground. And you swing at that pitch, most likely you roll it to a double play. On the ground. And that's wow. first Somehow that did not Rolling get the there. Third. No chance to get him. He's there. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. The corners with one gone. And now the first baseman, number five. That's an awful curveball. Dear God in heaven. The pitch. Now this one is smoked down the left field line. On its way, but it's fair. Out of here. This place is Now I know how San Diego felt yesterday. Kind of keeping them in check, keeping them in check, and then it's just kind of gone. And that's the difference. He made the he made the contact. I missed with Hanniger. I that's missed with Crawford. Yeah, we will get the difficulty decreased. Legend Plus often feels like garbage more than fun. So we'll go ahead and just shower this one off. Not worry about it, and we will uh, we'll move on to the next one. I know we have time. We can make a comeback. I have not been hitting well at all today. Missed opportunities. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Two outs. God, I fucking hate the circle change. I think I hate it more. Logan Gilbert, uh, when he throws it, because it is so slow. Pitch. Oh, and that deflects off his glove. On to first, and that is the inning. But the so a three-run home run hit so hard by Michael Stefanik it decreased the difficulty. This is now a six-one ball game. Slider has had, <clears throat> excuse me, Slider has not had location all game long. Back I shouldn't really worry about throwing it at this point, but. JP Crawford. Leading off for Seattle, the shortstop, J.P. The right hater back to work. Back to the mound. And that one finds its way through. 
Don't give up. Don't quit. I'm just, you know, don't throw in the towel. Understand, you know, hey, haven't haven't pitched well. Hitting's been some missed opportunities. In there, and it's on one. Usually, when a pitcher's had a dominant outing, he has hell? filled up the strike zone and he's gotten ahead in the count. The big fat bugs hitting the door. Strikes. Keeps well, doing that. Exactly I wonder if this, uh, the pressure is changing. Over 70%. Keeps like moving, uh, like, keeps popping. It's weird. That's a bad swing. Yeah, really bad. Really, really bad. Really fucking bad. And at first, now bad. And now for Seattle, Adam Frazier. Adam. To the right side. Lays out, but he can't squeeze it. Tosses to the pitcher covering the bag. Frazier retired. Now the catcher up to hit. Cal Raleigh. Whoa. First offering misses badly for ball one. Man at second. Liner Damn it! Oh, I was early again on a curveball, a hittable curveball. The lead remains five. Uh, it's six just one. We're back in a new pitcher here to start the Casey Sadler's going to come on in. 51 games, 167 ERA, 5 and 2 record, 64.2 innings with 16 holes, 39 strikeouts, no walks. Pretty uh, even batting averages right around 230. Righties and lefties. Here at the ballpark, set for the last half of the seventh. Here's the second baseman, David Fletcher. The second baseman. There's a strike, Chris. You look at it. Wow. These are the spots where guys can come on, pitch well, instill some confidence in the manager, and all of a sudden. I mean, how was that cutter that bad? Well, in this final month, I mean, this is an audition period for the call ups, but it's also for that marginal reliever that was on the roster throughout the season to maybe step up and be on that playoff roster. Next pitch is popped up. Makes the grab one away. Now batting center fielder. And now Brandon. here's the speed threat outfielder Brandon Marsh for the fourth time tonight. Pitch misses inside. Ball one. Right-handed reliever. Sinker gets the bottom of the zone, and that's a strike. Right-hander kicks, deals. Swing and a miss. That's strike two. Kicks and deals. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. That's the second out. Two outs, bases empty. And next for L.A., Anthony Rendon. God damn it. It's not that far off. Two down, nobody on. And now it's even up. And here it comes. Slapped foul. And a pitch. Right side. Takes it himself. And that is the inning. And the Angels are gone in order. They lead it though, 6-1. He's T. Williams and Lewis coming Mike on up Meyer. here for the top of the eighth. Mike Mayers. 50 games, 4-5 record. 
46 innings with a 4.63 ERA. 97 mile an hour four seam and 88 mile an hour slider. 94 on the cutter. I'll take a hack at that. That's an Makes the grab on the run. And there's one away. He was all over that first pitch fastball and just barely missed it. Man, this guy was ready to hit. Thompson Williams in the box with one away as he takes ball one. Action in the Angels bullpen. Andrew Watts up and loosening in the pen. The 1 0. There's a strike. Fuck. Ball to strike. And another ball. Swing and a miss, and he waves at that one. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. That uh, should have been a strikeout right there. Absolutely disgusting how bad happening right now. Left hand batter waits. And a base hit right there. So they get a man aboard with a one out single. Well, that's one of those knocks where you almost expect to get some jabs from your teammates when you get back to the dugout. Could have let that pitch get a little deeper into the zone and tried to go the other way with it. Got it off the end a little bit, but found a hole up the middle. Kyle Lewis up next for the Mariners. He swings and fouls one off. I wanted it. That's a laser base hit. And they'll have runners at the corners after a one-out single. Seems like he got exactly what he was looking the for right there. Cool. You see a ball come Physically off the bat hit. like that, you know it was pretty much a perfect swing. And for me, I start wondering, and I'm looking on the computer, what was the exit velocity? This time, 106. An outstanding hitter in Cattell Marte. Liner, base hit. The run scores from third. It's 6-2. Throw comes in and holds the runner at third. They're at the corners now with still now only one away. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. To me, it's just... Yeah, he's not been hitting his spots. Swing. He wasn't trying to do too much with it. Just stayed I think this has been okay aggression. I mean, we saw the bad swing on the slider. So one out with two aboard. Mitch Hanniger up next for the Mariners. Okay, there's a bad swing on the slider. One. Oh, and one. Pitch. Again, early. Damn it. Looks like you got a little excited on that fastball. Got to think to yourself, you want to stay up the middle. That way, if you're a little bit early, you hit it out of the ballpark. If you're a little late, opposite field knock. Next pitch is downstairs. I mean, that is the second big hit I've missed with Hanniger. We missed. Mm. At the belt and fires. A game of misses today. Lewis. At third, Marte at first, one gone. Swing and a line drive, base hit out of the center field. In comes the runner from third, it's six to three. Well, he wasn't afraid to hit with two strikes. I think he choked up a little bit, maybe spread out, but he got the job done right there. In the game the oh, they're going to bring in a new guy, huh? Aaron Loop, 37 games, no record. Uh, 26 holds and 36 innings, 2.21 ERA. 38 to 14 strikeouts to walks. Righty's batting a little better than lefties, but not by much. First and second, one out. And now the shortstop, J.P. Crawford. Sinker at 95, cutter at 87, circle change at 82, slurve at 78. In there for strike one. Got to keep of the slur, very right slow. Your toes ready to make a play. If you can get this to the ninth with a three run lead, it should be a W. A one down. Swing. Oh, big swing at that. Cutter. 
Runners at first and second with one gone. Got him swinging. Got him. That got me with the cutter. Two. Oh, God. Lefty, lefty. I hate this pitching ball. angle. You know, right now, he's really in one, so I'm sure his mind is all over the place, racing, having a hard time sleeping. And there's the third That's good management right there it's for the Angels. I'm frustrated with myself. That was a terrible strikeout with Crawford. That was a really bad hit with uh, what's called uh, Toro. That is unfortunate. That is not what I want to see. That's not good. But it's good management to bring in that. Bring in that lefty. Terrible arm angle. That's in for a strike. Just throw away all the good work I've been doing. We have more hits than the Angels. Right to the play. They are getting hits like that, and I am not getting anything Brent like it. Digging for two. Pulls in with a double third hit for him today. And here's the catcher, Omar Narvaez. He's already homered in this game. That one's in there, 0-1. In the dirt, and the runner holds. No outs, runner on second. That one back up the middle, and it gets through. Here's Otani flying around third. Just ahead of the throw, he scores. And they lead by four. Picks himself up in RBI. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Yeah, just shot it through the air. Pinder stands yeah. in now and watches strike one. Pinder. Narvaez on at first. Nobody out. He deals. Stays alive. Swung on, popped up left side. Crawford settles under this one, and there's one down. The battle, number five. Number five, batted with one down, takes a strike. Next offering is downstairs. Fuck off. The pitch. That one's in. There we go. And it's one and two. Kicks and fires. Misses inside. Two and two. And the right hander deals. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. Two out. Came out of his mechanics there. Typically likes to shoot the ball the other way, but that time a little anxious. Newman in the box with two gone. And it takes a look at a called strike. Next offering is in for a strike. Perhaps not quite ready to hit. First two pitches by him for a couple of strikes. Now back is against the wall. He's going to have to figure something out and figure it out quickly. And the pitch. Newman tries to hold up, appeal to first, and he couldn't hold back. He's rung up on strikes. So they pick up a run on two hits, no errors, and a man left. Through eight full, it's the Angels seven and the Mariners three. Now we see Rysel Iglesias out of the bullpen. Hasn't pitched in a while. He's had the last five days off. All of those stats look very bad for me. This is a, this is a frustrating game. That's all right, though. We'll, uh, we'll just shower it off and move on to the next one, I guess. Up the middle. Fletcher fires over to first. Now one gone in the ninth. And now the catcher comes up to him. Cal Raleigh, one for three. That one ripped right center field. 
pulls it in on the warning track. Wow. Perfect contact and just still couldn't get it away from the defender. Keep Ryan Hayes, the next to hit. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Activity in the bullpen for the Angels. Jose Suarez getting ready to come in for Joe Madden. That one out to right. Pace hit as he All right, take a little, little base knock there with two outs in the ninth. Multi-hit game for him now, and with the lack of results he's been having lately, I'm sure he's feeling some relief. When you pop a ball up like that, you don't expect it to get you a knock too often, but right there, somehow he got it to drop in behind first base, and that's where ah. he could get to it. Out towards left center. He's got it. Okay, well, that's your ball game today. It, it was a weird start, and then it just kind of sucked for most of it. Um, the hitting, there, the pitching difficulty definitely got the best of me. We missed a lot of opportunities with solid hits. It's weird. It's unfortunate that, like, I, I missed a couple of hits, a couple of good hits with Haniger, and then we missed one with um, the J.P. Crawford as well. And then the one that we got in the ninth with Cal Raleigh is perfect, and it's still an out anyway, so... Uh, this game was a bit of a mess. The Angels I probably have given me some trouble, more trouble than I'm realizing. And uh, unfortunately, we have three more that we have to do against this team. And that'll be uh, through the rest of the weekend. A long weekend series. They said a wraparound series on uh, TV the other day. So we'll steal that term. Slider wasn't working today. I don't know. This one just kind of, this one sucks. It's the kinds of games I don't like seeing where it's like 11 hits, three runs scored, two of them in the eighth, two of them in the eighth. They made a good pitching adjustment to bring in a new guy. And that completely ruined anything I was, uh, was trying to do terrible strikeout with JP Crawford. And then just an awful hit with whoever bats behind him, Toro, I believe. So whatever. Key Brian Hayes, Mitch Hanniger and Cattell Marte. All of them were two for four with a ribby. Adam Frazier was one for four. He scored a run. Omar Narvaez, he is your player of the game. Three for four with a home run. Three ribbies, two runs himself. Michael Stefanik was two for four with a home run. He knocked in four and scored a run. A little surprised he was not the player of the game. Shohei Otani was three for four with a double and three runs. Chad Pinder, one for three with a run. Logan Gilbert gets tagged for six runs in six innings. He gave up nine hits, only struck out one. No walks, and he gets the loss. Noah Syndergaard, he gets the win. Seven innings, six hits, three strikeouts, one walk, one earned in this uh, Angels win in game one of a four-game set. Um, yeah. Rem always remember, like, save your stuff. Okay? Just want to throw that out there. Because I didn't even get my thumbnail. Oh, that's so annoying. Auto-utilize. Auto-utilize. Patrick Sandoval is 8-11 with a 4-8-0 ERA. He will be the starting pitcher for the Angels. Marco Gonzalez will be on the mound for the Mariners at 14-5 with a 3-1-8 ERA. Quick look at the uh, standings here. The Astros are 84-64. and That is two and a half games behind the Mariners for the American League West lead. We do have a pretty good... Um, we, like We would really have to fall over the last chunk of games to lose out on a wild card spot. But we are start we are making this a little bit closer than I would like it to be. Of course the Astros are a good team, so it's hard to hard to be too irritated with that. You know, if, if we're losing to the Astros, we're losing to a good team. It's the way we've been losing some games lately for me that's been kind of grinded my gears, especially that Atlanta 2-1 loss. Today just didn't go the way I wanted it to, but uh, that'll do it for today's game. Hopefully you enjoyed. We'll be back tomorrow for game two of this series and through the rest of the weekend to get uh, get this series done. Then we'll be off to Oakland. Thanks so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed baseball every single day at 7 p.m. Pacific time right here on the channel. So be sure to scroll down, subscribe, ring that bell. That way you're notified when I post new videos. As always, good sports and go Mariners.